Hello and welcome to the Golden America channel. In a bold rebuke of former President Donald Trump's recent remarks, Vice President Kamala Harris condemned his apparent encouragement of Russia to attack NATO allies who failed to meet their financial obligations. Speaking during a comprehensive interview on MSNBC's The Weeknd, Harris asserted that the American people would never tolerate a president who submits to the demands of a dictator, regardless of political affiliation. Harris, speaking from Germany where she was attending the Munich Security Conference, did not mince words in her criticism of Trump's rhetoric. She also took aim at House Republicans for obstructing the Biden administration's $95 billion foreign military aid package, which includes crucial support for Ukraine's defense against Russian aggression. Emphasizing the urgency of the situation, Harris urged Congress to act swiftly, highlighting the opportunity for America to demonstrate its unwavering support for its allies in the face of adversity. Despite the challenges in the House, Harris expressed confidence in the bipartisan support for the aid package, pointing to the successful passage in the Senate. She called for a vote in the House and vowed to continue pushing until the bill is passed. On the topic of Israel, Harris reiterated the U.S.'s commitment to Israel's right to defend itself, but stressed the importance of conducting military operations with utmost care to minimize civilian casualties. She expressed deep concern for the safety of innocent Palestinians caught in the crossfire in Rafah. While Harris stopped short of confirming any immediate action regarding U.S. weapon supplies to Israel, she underscored her apprehension about the dire situation facing displaced Palestinians in Rafah, emphasizing the need for measures to ensure their safety and well-being. If you've reached this point, thanks for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe, and stay tuned for more in our next video.